After completing his famous 12 labors, Hercules was finally freed from the service he had to render to King Eurystheus. He could then go his preferred way. Among his plans, he intended to take revenge on King Laomedon of Troy, who humiliated him by not paying for the service the hero rendered to the Trojan king when he saved the monarch's daughter from a sea monster. For this mission, he called a group of heroes, among them Peleus, Achilles' father, and Telamon, Ajax's father. Hercules led a fleet of more than ten warships towards Troy. Hercules and the men fought the Trojans on the beaches of Ilion. The Trojans were led by King Laomedon himself. The Trojan king, perceiving that victory against Hercules was impossible, tried to retreat into the city of Troy. Hercules prevented the Trojan gates from closing and stormed the city with his men. Telamon advanced through the streets of the city with uncanny courage, facing dozens of Trojans alone. For the first time, Hercules saw a braver man than himself and felt jealous. Telamon ran towards the royal palace to conquer the city, but Hercules went after him in a rage for feeling the glory eluding him. Telamon, noticing Hercules' growing anger and stemming from other episodes of the son of Zeus's unbridled rage, crouched down and started picking up stones from the ground. Hercules asked why he was doing this, and Telamon replied that he was gathering stones to build a statue in the hero's honor. Hercules was abashed by the answer and understood the error of his envious attitude. Hercules killed King Laomedon with a bow shot and started pillaging the city. The hero gave Telamon the princess Hesione as a slave, and he decided to make her his wife. Telamon said that she could choose a slave from among the Trojan nobles to serve her. She chose her brother, Poderces. In the future, this boy would eventually be rescued to fight for the throne that belonged to his father. He would become known as Priam, which means the rescued one. Hercules' feat of invading Troy further increased the hero's fame, which was already well known beyond the borders of the Greek world.